Now time for Family Matters. Today we are talking to Norman Schaefer, who along with his uh, wife Kirsten have decided to pack up their six children and travel across the country this summer. So why exactly did you decide to go on this 17,000 kilometer trip? Well, we found that um, people are uh, wanting to go a little uh, uh, travel on a budget this year. And uh, so we've decided to give people a few ideas on what they can do for travel within Canada. And so let's just explain exactly who is on this trip with you. There's yourself and your wife. That's right. And then you have your children. Yeah, we've got our children between the ages of 1 and 14 that are... Uh, all here with us. And when did you start this trip? You, did you leave at the beginning of this week? Um, well, actually, we uh, left uh, last Saturday. We left a day or two earlier than uh, planned, but uh, uh, we left last Saturday, and uh, our plan is uh, for the next two months we'll be traveling uh, across Canada, and then um, at the tail end we'll be driving back through the northern states. All right, so where did you leave from, and what have you been able to experience so far? Well, we left from Victoria at mile zero of the Trans-Canada Highway. And uh, up till now, we've uh, traveled through uh, British Columbia, Alberta, and we're now in uh, Battleford, Saskatchewan. And what so far have uh, you or your wife or the kids liked the most? Well, uh, yesterday we were at the West Edmonton Mall, and they really enjoyed uh, the water park there. Um, but uh, they've also really enjoyed the uh, Royal Tyrell Museum in, in uh, Drumheller, Alberta, as well. What we've been doing is we've been asking people um, on our website at CheapTicketsCanada.com for their suggestions of great places to visit in, in Canada. And we've got some great responses from people. and. Uh, We've actually been adjusting our route a little bit to uh, to to see some of the some of the great places that people have been suggesting for us to visit. Yeah, and the way that you've set up the trip, you've gone really high tech in that people can kind of almost follow along with you where you're going, read your blog entries, and 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 you know maybe uh, see a little bit of the country from home that they have not seen before, and maybe plan to one day do it. Yeah, we've actually uh, had a lot of people asking us, uh, you know, to let them know what's been going on. And so uh, we've been posting it on Facebook and Twitter as, as we go. Uh, we've also posted a number of things on, on YouTube. And uh, we're, yeah, we're posting blogs, taking photos as we go. All of our photos are GPS mapped, so people can actually zoom in to the map of Canada that we have posted to see exactly where we were when we took the pictures. And, uh, yeah, we're trying to um, make it as interactive as possible and and give people lots of wonderful ideas of of how to do uh, a a trip either within parts of Canada or the whole country if they'd like to themselves. So yourself, your wife, and your six children are on the road. You've almost been on the road for a week, uh, starting off on your Cross Canada tour. And how has it been when it comes to spending time together as a family? Because I'm sure that a lot of families don't get to spend as much time together as uh, you will be doing over the next couple of months by the time you get to the uh, other side of the country. Uh, Yeah, um, well, that's the main reason, really, we're doing all of this. And, um, you know, there's always uh, a couple of challenges. Uh, You know, you have to share a uh, very small space in a motorhome. Um, you know, 24-7 it seems, uh, but the kids have been really, uh, uh, you know, they've, they've done a great job, um, even with, uh, you know, the challenge of uh, being with a, a teenage brother all the time or, or what have you, but uh, it's, um, it, it's an amazing experience to be able to spend that much time together and to be able to um, basically... Uh, you know, get to know each other uh, on a closer quarters. <laughs> I was going to say, uh, you mentioned the, the, what is it, the, the six kids and the two of you, what you were traveling in, but you've got some kind of RV. That's right. So uh, we've got a 31-foot motorhome okay. that, uh, <laughs> that we're all together uh, in, and uh, that's where we sleep and, uh, and uh, do everything together. So we've got... Uh, 
you know, uh, school books and, and uh, books on Canada that we've been uh, pouring through as we go as well. Okay. I had memories of uh, back, in, uh, back in the day traveling across the country with my family. We did it in a two-door sedan. There was only five of us, though, but uh, that was uh, before the days of minivans and stuff. Uh, enjoy the journey. Are you going to be through Kingston at all, through this area? Uh, we're, we're planning on coming through that area there, yes. So uh, we're welcoming any ideas from people of what we can do when we arrive. All right. Was it CheapTicketsCanada.com? Was that the uh, email or yes, the uh, web? That's right, yes. Uh, okay, awesome. Really appreciate your time, Norman, and uh, happy traveling, safe traveling, okay? All right. Thank you very much. It's uh, 823 on fly. We'll come right back with T.